Uh, all right, so here we go. I want to read an email from Nerdist Podcast listener uh, Christopher Coleman, who is <laughs> is awesome. He wants to do this. Is what he wants to do. Hi, Chris and the Nerdist boys. That's us. Hi. Oh, obligatory opening line. I'm a huge fan of the podcast, and I love the hostful episodes. Scoring points already. <laughs> Uh, buckle up, this is a long email. Go. For the past couple weeks, my manager has been demanding I take a vacation. I don't really have any good ideas on what to do or where to go. But then I heard Chris is somewhat desperate, please. Somewhat desperate, I would say entirely desperate. Please, (laughs) for people to come to his show at the Wilbur Theater. Jesus Christ, please come to that show. Uh, sounds like a great way to spend a weekend. I've been to Boston once, fell in love, this guy lives in San Diego, uh, fell in love with the city and have been looking for any excuse to go back ever since. What better reason to see one of my favorite comedians perform? What better reason in all caps? One small problem. I don't know anyone that lives in the Boston area. Sad face. He wrote sad face. He didn't make mm-hmm. a sad face emoticon. Yeah, face. This, uh, oh God. Oh God. Oh this gosh. normally wouldn't be an issue. I've traveled alone many times before. I'm okay with staying in a hostel and dicking around one of the coolest cities in America uh-huh. by myself. But really, if I'm traveling across the country to see a stand up comedy show, I want this to be one of the most memorable weekends of my life, which is why I've purchased a couple extra tickets. Oh, Sh- shit. What? Yep, last night in a moment of drunken enthusiasm, I purchased a total of four <laughs> tickets to the show. Here is proof. And there's a picture. Drunken enthusiasm. That's, I should call my album that. <laughs> so here's what I propose. I will give three extra tickets to the fel- one fellow Nerdist fan that lives in the Boston area for the low, low price of hanging out with me that weekend. To find my new BFF, I'd like to run a contest of sorts on the Nerdist Facebook page, which, by the way, is facebook.com slash Nerdist. Basically, anyone who wants the free tickets would have to comment on the discussion thread that I will create. A brief explana- <laughs> number one, a brief explanation of why I should pick them and what and the fun we would have together. Fair enough. <laughs> you can go to the MIT uh, Museum. Yep. Two, the MIT uh, Museum. you can look for treasure under the city. Uh, two, what they have uh, what they have done to promote the show in the Boston area. This could range from updating their what Facebook the status with show information, posting flyers around town. I like the way this young man thinks. <laughs> I will then choose the winner, my new BFF, and we'll have the most epic noodle story filled weekend ever. So many noodle stories. Hopefully, this will encourage your Boston uh, Bostonian fans to promote the show and may even get more people to like the Nerdist Facebook page. I am okay with that. Yeah, me too. Uh, and so, and then he just uh, he included a couple uh, facts about himself, just so you can know. Know who he is? Name: Christopher Coleman. Age: twenty-five. Sex: male. Sexual orientation: heterosexual. Sexual ability: disappointing. <laughs> Religion: Doctor Who is my time lord and savior. Political leaning: neo-ironic hipster anarchist. Mm-hmm. Special skills: skipping, building blanket forts, magic tricks, rolling polyhedrons, dancing awkwardly when there's no music. Ability to look good in sweater vests. Probably making good spaghetti. Not being a rapist. Future aspirations. I pride myself in that. Actually. Yeah. Yeah. I, I put that on my special skills when yeah. I go out uh, for auditions. Not a rapist. Not, I'm, I'm, I'm good at not being a rapist. Future aspirations. Running a marathon. Convincing Jimmy Pardo to do the mega podcast, which he will never do. That is the worst idea I've ever heard. <laughs> Hugging Matt Myra. Never dying. Turn on boobs. Turn offs babies. I guess that about sums me up, he says. Uh, I'll try to resist putting up an image of Pedo Bear when posting the Facebook discussion thread. <laughs> but seriously... Thanks for letting us do silly things on your page. I know I've had a fantastic time in Boston at your show, no matter what happens. So that is that, awesome. That's going to be the thing on the Nerdist Facebook uh, fan page, Nerdist.com uh, or Facebook.com slash Nerdist. Uh, like us there. Then go see Christopher Coleman's post and make your plea as to why he should give you the three extra tickets that he's bringing along with him to hang out with him. What a fucking awesome idea. That's a idea. great idea. That's a great idea. I like it. I like that kid. I like his moxie. I like the cut of his jib. <laughs> 